extensive storm damage forced Hermitage middle and high school students to remote learning. And those students are in a different part of the building from where the repairs are being made. But our Haley Brooks took a look at the damage. Uh, my buddy that called me and told me the roof is blown off the school. I was like, no, you got to be kidding me. Hermitage School District still assessing the damage left behind after straight line winds tore off the roof. When it started lifting up, it just rolled it right back and I've never seen nothing like that in my life. Matt Hewitt is the district's facility manager. He was the first one to step inside the school after the roof was ripped off Friday. Right here is our computer lab. It was like a waterfall coming through the tiles, water standing everywhere, uh, on top of desks where computers were, taking keyboards, picking them up, just water pouring out of keyboards. The wind and rain damaging the library, computer lab, and four offices. Then Saturday came the second round of storms. It was really kind of devastating. And those winds did more damage to the wing of the building that had already been damaged. And then also um, pulled the roof off of a second wing of that building and did more damage as well. Superintendent Tracy Tucker says days later, there's still standing water in the building oh. and the extent of the damage is unknown. But they're still planning on finishing out the school year strong. Just get the ball rolling to get this thing up and ready and hopefully by uh, the fall uh, housing our classes back in that building. Hmm. Well, as of right now, the district says it doesn't know how much it'll cost to repair the damage or when those repairs will be complete. The discussion